He's a bodybuilder. Let's see. It's giving catfish. Mm. Bodybuilding wear. Oh, ew. Hey guys, what's up? It's Akila and I'm back with another episode of Limelight to Ranch Life, period. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Welcome to the series. Welcome to Akila. <laughs> if everyone can do me a huge favor and like this video right now, that would be greatly appreciated. If you are not new, welcome back and we are going to get straight into it. So we got our boy Corey here in the pool chilling, um, waiting for his wife to return and I believe she has return if you have not seen the last episode and you don't know where his wife was go check it out now because you're going to be lost and it's going to be spoiled for you because it's tea and it's delicioso okay <laughs> so anyway hey y'all okay so Corey's here doing his thing this yeah, this is actually so sad to see the relationship differences because her and and for that very reason today, Corey was sitting at home waiting for his wife. Oh, Corey stinks. Corey's going to go take a shower. Waiting for his wife to return just thinking like, I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what, what I need to do to fix this relationship. And what he decided is he's going to speak to his wife about going to couples counseling because Corey's bald head when we far away from him oh not the lag okay I don't know where she's going but what she really needs to be doing is coming to take care of this garden spray spray weed yeah what we really need to do is befriend one of these let's do the blue one because blue is my favorite color is blue anyone else's favorite color? I love blue. So what we need to do... Yeah, we need to be friends. S tell some jokes to this blue mini sheep. And we really gonna name it... Not Jelly... Jelly Bean kind of cute. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Jelly Bean is mad cute. Okay. I sound like a bird. Oh, Jelly Bean is mad cute. Anyway, whatever. Play with Jelly Bean. Hold on, because Jelly Bean about to be our friend. Pet jelly bean and hug jelly bean. What is this on my floor? What is this? Carrots? Where we get carrots from? They dug some carrots about my own marshmallow. And just fine. Mm. Oot, oot, oot. So she's taking care of the garden. He's taking his bath or whatever. And how oh they are enraged. Please apply the mite treatment. Oh not him. You don't do that. This is not this is not your business. What's wrong with Marshmallow? Marshmallow, you have some problems? Scared. What are you scared of? What is there to be scared of? Look at our baby jelly bean hole. Oh, I'm so excited. That name is so freaking cute. Jelly bean. Oh, I was very confused. Because I know both horses was over here at one point. And for some reason, I thought they were both still here. So when I saw this horse, I said, who the hell horse is that? As course to play. Velvet, go play with the ball. Thank you. Okay, so Corey's done showering. Oh, she's over here. So then after he does that. Talk to Marshmallow. 
calm marshmallow down. Because I don't understand what the... What is marshmallow scared of? Like... Okay. And we can talk to our father. Look, wait! This is so cute, y'all. Look. Look at my sis embracing. Look at her and Jelly Bean. Oh my gosh. Does she love the ranch now? Because this is actually so cute. Oh, means no, mama. She said, who needs kids when you have a <laughs> jelly bean? Look, she's feeling very playful. Okay, can't, no, still not get enough friends. Okay, all right. I mean, like, how far do we have to get? Like, is it even moving? Hello, jelly bean, if you could stop thinking about that so I can see the bar. Oh, okay, well. Ooh, silly goose, telling a joke to many sheep, many sheep, fluffy friendship, excellent meal, packed with love, friendly fluff, like touching a cloud. Okay, so that's where we are. Girl, what? No, you're not. Wasn't it just sunny? It's something Y'all being very incredibly dramatic, and I don't like it. Okay. That's enough. It's enough. Corey's going to come over here and talk to his wife. He's going to talk to her about marriage, you know. You know, there's, there's a lot going on. Oh, oh, excuse me. Where's Bindo uh -uh. Yomp? Oh, Bomb. Bewitched from feeling child. I just hope it's Corey and not. Because remember in the last episode, he pulled up on us. And I don't understand how that even happened. So now, oh, who this? Now we got to be careful. Okay. But why does she do that if she's feeling enamored? Hmm. Huh. they love each other but they having they having problems okay so that didn't it's go like so well place. let's see what else we can do ask to go get tested would be actually quite hilarious considering the fact that she is a <laughs> cheater <laughs> oh oh no we're not going to do that. We're not going to. Are we going to do that? I'm not going to do it now. But if you want to see that, let me know. That. I'm going to do it, actually. I'm going to do it. Express suspicions about closeness with his parents is actually insane. That that would actually be incredibly ridiculous. But Nisoda, ah, Mooj, Shwebi Taringa, because he's like, look, oh, I told Bernard you Latour. that is just my friend. We work Basimu. together. This is this is out of line. You are out of pocket. How could you, darling? You're worried. Oh, you're worrying over nothing. We're just friends. I'm telling you, she's just trying to tell you, y'all just friends. They're just friends, Corey. Okay. I wish they would stop running away because I'm not done with you yet. There are other things. What? Where is the mod? I put a mod in here, y'all. Uh, I think they have to first 
have a deep conversation. I think he first has to like convince her to go and then where the heck do you find it that so I'm not sure why it's not working uh, now. Murban um, Oh, boom. Elfrisium Ask to go to couples counseling. Where the heck was that? Y'all, I swear I paused this game and was trying to find that for a calm, like, five or ten minutes. Ish, ish. Five or ten minutes. <laughs> They're reminiscing Elvis, about their wedding uh, day uh, uh, right now. Um, Chicks from Bluff? And I think it was an uh, awkward encounter. Now you can go to counseling together anytime using the computer interaction, book couple cou couples counseling in the order menu. So, let's go and do that. Um, in the order menu, order book couples counseling session. Because they need it. They really we need, need it. We need a new Hold on, do Jelly Bean have a, excuse me? Is Jelly Bean in love? Jelly Bean, is this your boo? Is this your baby? Let's give them a name. No. No. Uh, Poppy's not it. Poppy is absolutely not it. Um, let's see. We have jelly bean. Maybe we can do like gumball. That's cute. And don't if you say it's not, you're a hater. And I'm I'm so sorry that you're a hater. I'm sorry, but you are. If you say that gumball and jelly bean are not cute for the green and the blue mini sheet. I'm sorry. Don't be a hater all your life though. It it doesn't look good on you. Okay. Yes, he's going with Kendall. Okay, they are going to go to their relationship counseling. It costs $150. Let's hope that it can save their relationship, yeah? Ooh. Hello? Oh, bye, white hen. Didn't I do that like in the last episode? Okay. All right, y'all. I'll be back. I've returned only to say that they are both very focused on their ongoing counseling session. Um, so that is promising. That seems like a good thing. That the look, he even has on his focus face. The the focus, focus, focus face. She's also focused. Y'all. <laughs> Yeah, they back. Why Kendall said no progress. That counseling session didn't really seem to do much. Maybe another time will be better. While he is very oh he's oh let me see he didn't get home yet maybe his oh I'm nervous. Oh he mm, no progress with him either. Okay, well, and then he's about to come do oh he about to oh wait. He about to blame her for their relationship problems. Oh, y'all. I thought that was supposed to help. First of all, I need Corey to be for real. Put some clothes on. So I can get a thumbnail. <laughs> like, please. Gracias. Wait. That is T, ain't it? She said me. I'm the problem. I'm the oh. drama. Oh. Wow. Oh, she is angry. No progress. How are we even family from difficult family dynamic? Oh, 
Corey struggles to comprehend how he can be related to some of his family members. Family can be so difficult sometimes. I Dios mio. Is that how y'all say it? Dios mio. <laughs> y'all, I'm so unserious. Okay. She has the same thing for him. Uh, also, hypocrite from partner's criticism. It seems hypocritical to Kendall to be blamed by her partner for the full responsibility of their relationship problems. And it's a little maddening. Yes. And then she's very angry because y'all know Kendall gonna always be angry. If there's one thing that Kendall is going to do, it's be angry. Like, if we ever have an episode where Kendall does not get angry, I might have to stop the series, quite frankly, because... <sighs> All right, where's my sister's drink? Her drink of choice. Yes, let's get her... Let's make her a little drinky drink. Honestly, I think Corey's going to go out tonight. I think Corey, you know, last episode we focused on her. She did her little acting thing or whatever. I think this episode, where are he going? What is he going to play in? What in the fuck? What is this? <laughs> Corey, if you don't grow up, this is what Kendall be talking about with show ass. Okay. Corey gonna come. No. Stop it. I'm gonna have him just take a little nap. Just a little nappy nap. Um, so he's not so tired when he goes out. She's going to drink this. Yes. And then I want her to come and make some. Do we have stuff to okay we have apples and we have grapes period okay so she's going to craft up some grape nectar when she's done with her drink hopefully this drink makes her feel better it is it is speeding up the process and you know just a little lick look she's her boredness is going down never good enough from fear of failure okay but wait but wait because what in the world from feeling smitten because she's near her husband. They are both actually like losing it. Legitimately losing it. Huh. Me ants go marching <laughs> one by one, hurrah. Hurrah. Girl, come on, you're not new to this. You aren't new to this, Kendall. Don't we have bottles in here? Let's see what's happening. Oh, again, another one. Yes, let me see what's happening with our bottles, please. Okay, not yet aged. Moderately aged. Hold on, 495 some Oh my goodness. Are both of them? Oh, oh. It's poor, but it's... 495 and this one is also poor but it's 110 okay. okay girl finish the drink yeah she called girl go on ahead and finish the nectar she had to change it to her lemon pepper steppers period oh we need to hang what is is this for her garden? Yes. See, we need to get, um, we need to get a freaking, can we make something out of this that we can like maybe sell? What can you do with pumpkins? Hmm. Can something? No, not mushroom. Um... Mmm, apple jam. Okay, well. Okay, we have a bottle. It's still poor. Please. Okay, whatever. We're going to put that in here so it can age. All right, it's nine o'clock. We are going to head out with uh, his 
Oh, he didn't really. Mm-mm. His nap should have done a little bit better than that. Okay. We're going to head out with Corey. Corey is going out because he is just fed up. He needs to make some new brands. I think I put a new one of these things down. Like that I got from the gallery, of course. Um, he's going to go by himself. He's going to have some drinks. He's going to hopefully meet him a friend that can become like his best friend. Somebody he could just talk to about what's going on in his life. You know, because his wife is stressing him out, poor thing. And if he doesn't find a friend tonight, then I just have to make it. This is me trying not to have to make a friend, y'all. It's okay. It'll be okay. Because Oh, I didn't mention it on this LP yet. I mentioned it in, in my Growing Together LP. I am starting a new LP. And y'all might be thinking, girl, you can't even keep up with the LPs you have now. <gasps> is God's night? Gentlemen Sims can saunter up to the bar for a discount drink. Period. He better saunter. You better saunter. Come on, Corey. Yeah, so I'm starting a new um LP. But it's like a... It's not new, but it's new. Because I'm bringing back an old LP and an old family. Um, and basically like reviving it. Rebooting it. A reboot, if you will say. Um, so, yes. I have been working diligently he need like a manly drink. What's is this a manly drink? A barley bale. That sounds manly. Yeah. So I'm bringing back another uh, old family and starting up a new LP with that family. So then I will have three LPs going on this one, growing together, and the new one. So be on the lookout for that. It is coming very soon. Maybe after I post this video, that'll be the next. Why y'all doing that to him? Hello? Wait, where's the... Where's the fucking bartender, please? Okay. Oops. They stressing me out. Who's this? Rabbit Montgomery. His name is Rabbit. 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 Rabbit Montgomery. So, so. Um. Yeah. Um. Uh, <laughs> uh, maybe he can play with his new buddy Rabbit. I don't even know. Does he play chess? I don't know. But like, Rabbit don't look too bad. Like I feel like I wouldn't have to make Rabbit up too much if I give him a um, makeover. Discuss his interest with Rabbit. Who's this? Umber Grow. Umber's cool looking. I like Umber. I like Umber's style. The hair with the little vest and the the t-shirt. I like it. I'm here for Umber. What does he have on that's making people react crazy to him? It's gonna piss me off. Uh, let's put on a different outfit to see if we can stop that because I don't I don't want to do that. Okay. Hopefully that works. Let's discuss interest with Umber. Look at him making friends. Ask Umber about his day. Do we have a bartender? Because how how is it a man's night? Oh there's another bar somewhere okay i really hate that where's the bar? where's the drinks where's the bar where's the bartender i just want a barley bale for freak's sake okay i don't think we're asking for much oh this is the bartender okay okay let's try this barley bale take uh, He's still bored, poor Tank. Your friends is There's no fun. Shibar blue hay. What well, would he like to do? Him. Listen to some R and B Chris music, Bacrosh. dance to stereo music, and look at the bright side. Aww. Okay, he needs to order something to eat too because he is a tad bit hungry. 
Um, I always go for fish and chips. I just be feeling like it's the simplest thing. Like, not her feeling they have a casual conversation while dancing. Why is Marcus Fox that color? Is he cold? Why hasn't he thought of Rabbit, are these your friends? Let's go talk, finish talking to Rabbit. Oh. Ask Rabbit about the community. Hey, Rabbit, come sit with your friends. Come sit with us at this table. Put that on my mama. Who is this? Tomax. Stop it. Isn't this the guy? the guy y'all hold on let me please hold this is what Tomac's supposed to look like and this is what he actually looks like excuse me <laughs> like please be for real like what the freak is happening because this is a completely different person okay okay fine Fine. I just. Tomax, do you have any clothes? Hmm. I'm in genuine, like, disbelief. Because this man. No. Completely two different people. Oh, oh who we done kicked up off that table so he can sit down? Oh, the dancing lady. Now she's sitting at the piano. Oh, where's my best friend Rabbit going? Community board. You can find additional information about the community by using the community board. You can also purchase one for your home. We have one. Thank you. Okay, where are you going now? Now you're still in your friend seat? Oh, she made a mess. Did y'all see that? If I remember, I'm going to run it back to y'all in the edit. Tomax is very angry. angry. We can't be friends with him because he reminds us of our, of our wife. It's giving PTSD. Like, all these men working around, walking around shirtless. Now, I really need to fix my game, but I just, without me having to go and actually put clothes on everyone, I don't know how to do it. I don't know. Shall we give a makeover? We're going to give Rabbit a makeover, and I think I'm going to change his name because I honestly don't know what a rabbit is. Like, why is that your name? Why is your what? Name rabbit? Shoots day. Okay, he lives alone. Stetson, Odin, Carlton Montgomery. Hmm. Trenton Montgomery? Hmm. Edward, Shan Chandler, Renee, Corey with the K, and Corey with the C, besties. Jackson. Okay, we're going too far. I'm gonna call him Trenton Montgomery. His pronouns are he, him. He's an adult. He's lactose intolerant. He's unflirty, and he's proper. He's a bodybuilder. Let's see. It's giving catfish. Mmm. Bodybuilding wear. Oh, ew. Blech. Ew. No, that's disgusting. Okay. Anyway, let's get into this.
okay, this is my boy Trenton Montgomery. He looks exactly the same. The only thing that has changed for real is his name. He looks the same, and you're not going to convince me otherwise. And he's cute. I tried to keep his style. They say he's proper. He was kind of dressed up, like, you know, business casual-ish. So I gave him that. I just made him look better, period. He kind of looked like he could be Corey's brother, for real, if I'm being honest. Like, is this his brother? I don't know. But that's his makeover. He looks phenomenal. Great job, Akila. His middle name could be Rabbit. He could be Trenton Rabbit Montgomery. Montgomery. <laughs> TRM Trimmer. Mm -hmm. Now we back home. Bye. I'm leaving. Okay, we back. My boy's Trenton Rabbit looking good. Go to oh, is he oh excuse me? Where is y'all going? The party is just getting started. Everybody go home at 1230? Oh, that's him telling the dramatic story. Well, let's go get us another drink before the whole sh just shut down. Okay, oh, it's a new batch of people coming. Let's see. Who y'all? Another one. Thank you. I thought she was going to take my drink, y'all. And I was really holding my breath because I was like, if I have to smack her as a man, that's going to be very unfortunate. Because why would you take my drink? Buddy, come sit. Come chat. What's wrong with him? He's bored. I feel that. Who are you going to slow dance together with? With his bestie? Stop it. Stop it. He could go cowpoke dance and then he could get people to dance for him. Tonight you gonna dance with me. Dance with me. These chairs are actually so freaking cute. Did they come with the new, like with this pack, this this cowpoke, I mean this uh, ranch life pack? They're really cute. I like them. And they fit the aesthetic, so... He kind of got to use the bathroom. Okay, he has to use the bathroom. Oh, you should go. You should go. You should go use the bathroom. Because if you pee on yourself... Oh, our buddy Rabbit left. Did our friends leave? Okay. It might be time for us to go. Because this new this new batch of people, we don't know them. They are not our friends. This space is really cute, though. Whoever did this build. Like, th even this, like, just to be able to sit here, like, overlooking the town. Oh, stop. This is so freaking... Y'all. If you sit in here and this is your view while you're eating and having some some beverages stop this is mad cute oh i went too high okay whatever but y'all see what i'm y'all get it this is cute picture okay what did he go get another drink oh oh he's stealing somebody drink a tang and zing okay i'm not mad at it because they be stealing our drinks this is gonna be his last one though because his friends is gone he don't have no more friends oh he making new friends who's hinata hinata okada who's this desmond hampton y'all you know who this guy look like to me y'all if you watch big brother <laughs> if you watch big brother on this season he reminds me of Cameron. 
Is he drunk? Smooth sipping. Deep connection. That's my jam. Last exception. Oh, that sounds dangerous. Y'all, this guy look like Cameron. Every time I look at him, I think about it. All right, we're going to go home because it's becoming too much. Could he have drank that? The sweet and spicy? I kind of wanted him to get drunk. He had three drinks. And he just from smooth sipping. That's it. Meanwhile, any other sim will have one drink and be talking about they tipsy, they drunk, they hungover because they are dramatic. Ooh. Corey running home like, don't do you out with a girl like that. <laughs> I hope that you and your wife can be civilized. Okay, so we're back at the house. And I was just sitting here thinking like, so my plan, like what my plan for the next episode would be, and I'm thinking it would be for her to start taking all this stuff that she's, like for one, the nectar and like all these things that she's planting. I do really want to get her garden together, but like start to like make money off of it, right? And then I was like, dang, she really makes all the money for the house. Like, what the heck does Corey do? to like bring in money other than maybe like horse races that's another thing now that we have like a younger horse i want to try to do more horse races oh look at velvet yeah let's actually have her where is it at let's have velvet come over here and practice her jumps yeah let's do that hello hello yeah she needs to practice her jumps because we need sis and tippity toppity shake it is 5 30 in the morning okay spray oh, wait no Spray area for bugs, and then you'll be done out here. I promise. And then you need to apply mite treatment and collect honey and hope that the bees don't sting you. Y'all, tell me what can I do with the pumpkins? What can I do with pumpkins and what can I do with watermelon? I feel like I want to, we need to grow some grapes because we need that to make nectar. Maybe we'll grow more. Are they in season? No. This is what, y'all, we gonna, mm-mm, mm-mm. I gotta get my, um, greenhouse. Because this is not going to work for me. It's genuinely not going to work for me. I wanna put this stuff in the fridge so it doesn't go bad. Um, this is also fall season. Y'all, can I just make a small, can I just greenhouse the stuff that's in like, or if I just like cover it, right? We gonna figure this out because I need this stuff. Absolutely not. Did y'all see all that shit going to my inventory? There will be none of that. Do you hear me? I'm gonna have her. <laughs> Absolutely not. It can't go into the household inventory. That can't be a thing. She has to. I think she just has to harvest everything. 
So what's out here? Uh, harvest all. She's gonna harvest everything. I'm. I can't do it. Girl. And then spray the area for bugs. And I don't know how anything would need watering when these damn sprinklers are just on. But water, whatever needs to be watered. Okay, so now everything is in her actual inventory, which makes it easier to deal with. And now I'm going to go and then still... Um, put uh, the roof over it. Or whatever. Okay. Now that that's done, because that scared the crap out of me. Because if you remember, I don't remember what episode it was where I had to like go and manually freaking. I wasn't about to do that. Does this allow it to be sheltered? Yes. Okay, good. So now she can plant these grapes. Sis needs to go. Hey, Kendall, we need a celebrity partner to help promote TV dinner, a basic cable television channel as part of a targeted advertising campaign. Complete one of the following options in the next 24 hours to fulfill, to fulfill the contract. Use a video station to upload any video footage you've captured or TV dinner. Would love footage of you personally cooking if you use the drone to upload a video focused on cooking your payment will be even larger okay so now i forgot we have this lady um who our gardener okay so let's evolve our avocado tree we have a pomegranate tree we have a plantain tree and we have a cherry tree um that's pretty pretty good uh we have taro root somewhere lily flower quill plant noxious elderberry bush a carrot plant another carrot plant carrot Green pea, green pea, um, morels, or, okay, so we have a lot of stuff, um, I don't want to harvest all this stuff because I really don't know what to do with it right now, but quill fruit, excuse me, like, that's worth a lot of money avocados are fine sage pineapples parsley okay so i'm gonna have to figure out what we're gonna do with all of this stuff because what like yeah i'm gonna have to figure out what we're gonna do with all of this stuff i met i did all of the gardening stuff i forgot we had a gardener a grape failed to germinate try putting it on a more open place okay whatever let the gardener handle it. I think I'm gonna end here though. I feel like at some point I was in the middle of a thought and didn't get it out, but like, you know, that's the story of my life. Velvet is still doing good. Velvet is out here crushing it. Girl, you want, oh, she needs to eat. No, let me get her knees together before I just close out the video. That's kind of messed up. I don't think she ate anything all episode. Let's see, is there anything in the fridge? Oops. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff, but like she can eat. I mean, that's all they've been eating, poor things, is fruit salad. I guess she could eat a plate of bread and some fruit salad. Girl dinner. Right? Uh, grab a serving. Okay. And his needs. He's, uh, he's also hungry. All right, I guess we can stop this, right? Send home. 
Their bills have been delivered in the amount of 14,000 simoleons. And this is what I'm saying about the fact that we need to figure out how we are going to sustain this ranch because it is very, very expensive to do so. 14,000 simoleons. Child, go pay him now. Get it out the way because, oh my gosh, yes. Good to hear your voice. I wanted to ask if you if I should get to know Michelle Hoffman a little better as a friend. They seem like good company. Sure, go for it. Okay, next episode, guys. Let me tell you what we're going to do before I forget. Oh, what's spoiled in there? what there's so much okay anyway 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 next episode <laughs> y'all i get so sidetracked i don't know how y'all be just putting up with me next episode we are hold on okay next episode <laughs> we are either going to fix this greenhouse during the episode um and a speed build or i will fix it off camera well I'll fix it outside of the video, but like record it and just enter the speed build in the next episode. Uh, haven't decided yet. I'll see what the spirit moves me to do. We're going to be selling stuff, hopefully, um, because as you can see, this money is not gonna last. You know, good things don't last forever. This money is not gonna last us forever. And I don't understand how this apple nectar is not aged yet. Is it just not going to age? Because I'm almost certain we made the apple nectar before we made any grape nectar. So, yeah, but we're going to keep letting it. Actually, we're not going to sell this. But Kendall has a lot of stuff in her inventory that she should be able to sell. So we're going to look through this and see what we need, what we don't need, and get rid of stuff. Um, additionally, we are going to enter a horse race with Velvet because... Y'all, should she take a pregnancy test? Should I end the episode like that? Take a pregnancy test. Not her stinking. I think I'll, should I leave that on a cliffhanger? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Anyway, so she's taking a pregnancy test. We will see what the results are in the next episode, along with fixing the greenhouse, selling stuff, horse racing, and anything else that you guys let me know that you may want to see. Someone also put in the comments, hold on, let me go look at it because I'll be forgetting y'all because sometimes I record this stuff so much like later. Please hold. Okay, so someone commented on one of the older videos that you can do ranch events with the sheep and goats and that you can do yoga or meditation classes or events with them. I'm not sure about, I don't know anything about that, but if that's true, that's definitely something we can look into. Um, what other comments? What other comments? Train the animals on their own. We've already done that. Um, and fertilizing plants. Okay, great. So I think that's it. So yes, we can do ranch events. So maybe also in the next episode, we will be planning for some sort of ranch event. Not sure which one. I guess we just have to see what they are. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like the video if you didn't already. Drop a comment below. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Kendall is not pregnant. Ba -da -ba. She stinked though. Damn.